In this video, we're going to find a confidence interval for a proportion. We're going to focus on problem number 15 here. It says a survey showed that 200 kids like chocolate and 50 do not. We want a 90% confidence interval for the proportion of all kids who like chocolate. So it wants a confidence interval for a proportion. So in StatCrunch, we click on the button here that says Stat, and we go down to Proportions, and then One Sample, and then with Summary. Then you left click. It's asking for the number of successes. So in this problem, we're, we want a confidence interval for the kids who like chocolate. So success is liking chocolate. So we have 200 kids that like chocolate. So successes is 200. And here's the tricky part. The number of observations. Well, if we have 200 kids that like chocolate, and 50 do not, we have to add. So we actually have 250 kids total, because 200 plus 50 is 250. Then we click here where it says confidence interval, and it looks like we have to change it to 90%. So let's go ahead and do that. And then looks like we're good to go. We just go ahead and click compute, and we should have the answer. And there it is. There's the lower limit of the confidence interval, 0.76, and there's the upper limit of the confidence interval, 0.84. I hope that made sense.